a beautiful thing about al-wahhab that Allah Azza wa Jal gives these gifts and does not require anything in return, unlike humans. When you think about, again, the last gift you were given, depending on who gave it and how and so on, I was just visiting family, right? I just came from a, a trip in which I was visiting family and carried gifts with me, right? Because that's what you do. When people are distant and far from you, you want to, right? Kindle that bonds of family with gifts, right? Imagine many of you carry gifts when you visit your family or you're expected to carry gifts, <laughs> potentially. <laughs> but anyhow, there is a sense of a reciprocity. You gave me, so therefore I must give you, right? Or you remembered me, I should remember you. Or shame on me that I didn't remember you, or so on. There's, however, none of this exists with Allah Azza wa Jal. He gives and does not request or require that you give him anything in return. In fact, there is nothing we can actually give Allah Azza wa Jal. Even our own obedience to Allah is for us and not for him. <laughs>